Hi folks, Instructional Coordinator Adrian at Coronada Historic Site. I'm filming alone on site today, so I'm gonna go ahead and take off my mask. Hi, I'm Instructional Coordinator Adrian at Coronada Historic Site in Bernalillo, New Mexico. Today, I'm going to be introducing you to two plants as part of our ongoing series highlighting the native plants of Coronada Historic Site and the Rio Grande Valley. This flowering plant is called gypsum scorpion weed and is native to New Mexico. Its scientific name is Phasalia integrifolia and it's a member of the borage family. Gypsum scorpion weed grows up to 20 inches in height in arid sandy soil. It is recognizable by the five pale lavender pink petals that contrast with the deep purple stamens tipped with blue anthers. The bloom stem curls with a tip hooked like a scorpion's tail, thus giving the plant its name. It has stout, sticky, hairy stems and leaves with scalloped edges. The second plant I have for you today is called Fendler's Spring Parsley. It's a native perennial herb that can be found only in the southwest. This plant is a member of the parsley or carrot family and its scientific name is Cymopteris glomeratus variety Fendleri. The genus name Cymopteris is from the Greek cyma which means wave and pteron which means wing referring to its seeds. The variety name Fendleri honors Augustus Wilhelm Fendler, a Prussian botanist who was the first to collect this plant for science on gravelly hills around Santa Fe in 1849. Fendler's spring parsley likes to grow in dry sandy areas on the plains and foothills. It grows low to the ground and has glossy dissected leaves. The yellow flowers grow in clusters of six to nine branches on stalks that are longer than the leaf stems. So there you have it folks, gypsum scorpion weed and Fendler's spring parsley, two native plants at Coronado Historic Site and the Rio Grande Valley. Thanks so much for watching.